Another question. In the first uh, excerpt, if we can get back to it, how the faith in the descent being given from above, and now the descent gives me an opportunity to make corrections, what exactly are the corrections? There's only one correction. We talked about it. The greatness of the Creator in our eyes. No more. And the greatness of the Creator in our eyes can be measured only towards disturbances. That I feel the greatness of the Creator upon which disturbance can I overcome and which one I can't overcome. And it remains before me as a problem. And the greatness of the Creator can't help me. This disturbance is there before me and concerns me. That is called that Still, the greatness of the Creator in my eyes is enough. But through that I see that I'm lacking the greatness of the Creator. I'm lacking it because the disturbance is there before me and I can't hide it. Well, even if I say, yeah, the Creator has to be great, none else besides Him good that does good, nothing helps. So there's a place to pray. To pray. And here, this is the prayer. You, it's a good place that is revealed. Okay, and what? Rav, just to be certain that I understood your last words, any thought that I have besides greatness of the Creator is a disturbance that I need to overcome? It's a disturbance that shows you that you're lacking the greatness of the Creator. And then you have a place to pray that the greatness of the Creator will come and cover that disturbance, that the disturbance won't be before you as something that stands there as a disturbance or a confusion, it doesn't matter what, can be positive or negative. Positive if it draws you, it doesn't threaten you, but also in such a way it can be worse because it can disconnect you from the greatness of the Creator or that it threatens you, and that's better. The Creator that brings all kinds of suffering, threats, it's good. By this, we right away straighten up and we're ready. But if He brings all kinds of pleasures, so by that He disconnects us. By this, we're weak in that, meaning there's a double disturbance. If it's a disturbance in a form that I feel fears and anxieties, that's a regular disturbance and it's good. But if it's a disturbance that pulls me to it, because the bad kind pushes me away, it distances me from it, and a pleasant one draws me in, that's a worse disturbance. It's the Eshet Znunim and all kinds of uh, depictions. The thought of, crea- of the greatness of the uh, the greatness of the Creator does it become a feeling as well, or it stays a thought? Meaning, it fills your mind, or it fills also all of the degree. The greatness of the Creator seems as a light that fills everything. <laughs> 